the year 1841. The place, Virginia. I live in a Charles City County. This is my horse, the General. I am John Tyler, the 10th President of the United States and the Charles City County, Virginia. And guess what? They want me to make my own bills to battle. And they want me to use my pants to cuddle bills for my wig party. And you know what that means, ladies and gentlemen. Well, my friend, you can kiss your simple country ways goodbye. Oh. And now, here's your host, Mike Morris. Hi, everybody. Hi, Mike. Today, we have an extra special revolution for you. The Industrial Revolution. It's going to change the way you live. Standing next to me is Farmer. Are you excited, Farmer? Who are you, and what have you done with my traditional agriculturally based economy? It'd be easier to say what we haven't done. Right, audience? Hi, Mike! Farmer Willoughby, what do you do for a living? Well, I work the land as my people have for generations. Right! And look at some of the rickety homemade junk you've had to use. Yuck! Yes! Oh, I hate this! Don't worry, Mr. Tyler. We'll take something care of our new find. We're with you too, the John Tyler Morgan, starring one of the world's greatest American patriots, the 10th President John Tyler, with today's special guest, Daniel Webster. Come on, aren't you missing something in your life? Like what? Like the mechanized production of manufactured goods on a large scale, of course. Hey. How'd you make that stuff? Tell them, misinformation. It was made by mass production, Mike. And here's the inventor of the process known as mass production. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. I am Daniel Webster. Today, John Tyler created the metal bills for the wig party. And you know what we called? The wig party of John Tyler for metal bills to use the pen. So tell us, Spike, what does John Tyler's gonna do? Is he gonna use his pen to write down his metal bills? Hi, everybody! Hi, Eli! Eli, what have you got for us? Well, Mike, mass production leads to a concept we call interchangeable parts. Hold on, interchangeable parts? That's a weird name. What's it mean? It means Farmer Willoughby will be able to purchase large numbers of items that are identical to each other. Wow, that's an amazing revolution. <laughs> and that's what the Industrial Revolution is all about. People making machines that make stuff faster, better, and cheaper. So what do you think, Farmer Willoughby? Interested? Uh, I'm not sure. Ah, I know you. You're worried about the price. Fair enough. Misinformation. How much is the Industrial Revolution going to cost Farmer Willoughby? That's the exciting part, Mike. By going industrial, Farmer Willoughby can count on... Lose in touch with the land, sweatshop working conditions, and overcrowded, disease-ridden cities. Yeah. It's Loud Kiddington and his dog, Fetch. Howdy, Roman citizens. Loud Kiddington here. And if I can't make to a deal, my dog Fetch will eat the metal muffin. Tell me something I don't know. Forget about him. I'll take it. <laughs> so long, the beats. Talk too loud, talk too loud, talk too loud. Stop! <clears throat> well, it looks like whip party kicked off John Tyler for using his own pants to be stolen. Well, I guess that John Tyler Pokemon is finally, finally over. Report back to me next year while John Tyler finds his own pen by soul by soul.